it is said that if we want to live like a child, go back to the village. We started our journey at Sikles village, situated at an altitude of 1,981 meters. A beautiful Gurung village located in Madhi village development committee, Kaski district in western Nepal. On the lap of Annapurna range, where smiles welcome our hearts. picturesque view of Annapurna range felt like I am in a dream where I feel the heaven. Is it heaven or am I dreaming? It's not the best path but it's the best place to be. We had our breakfast at Glacier Viewpoint, a 30 minutes walk from Sikles, which offers the best scenic view of Annapurna Range. I had a chat with the friendly local, Samar Guru, who explained the importance of Sikles and actual origin place of Gurung tribe. He also describes the transformation of place and its vulnerability to modernization, which can kill the essence and identity of this beautiful village. Journey of thousand miles starts with a single step. I started my journey from viewpoint and the ultimate destination was Kopuche Glacier Lake. This journey was a way to find peace. I know I can't find peace anywhere else but within myself. But while I trek, legs burn, sweat drops fly by, thirst and hunger make me forget everything. And just concentrate on one thing, just to enjoy the majestic view along the trail. For me it's a meditation, religion, happiness, a reality, a way of life. It's where I can find inner peace. It's been five months since my father passed away and I can remember he begged for life. But life had some other plans. And at the moment, I came to realize that we shouldn't beg for life, but to embrace death instead. At least we should try to be ready for it and live like there's no tomorrow because there isn't one. Before I die, I should be able to reveal my true self, my true purpose, a way to salvation. Cool breeze blows my hair gently and I close my eyes and smell the nature and the feeling is fabulous. An endless road towards happiness. Thinking about future can only bring sadness. Let's enjoy this moment. Let's be mindless. This journey is amazing towards nothingness. One of the purest elements in the universe is water. It's the best thing to quench my thirst. And when I find it on the lap of nature, I can say it's just priceless. It's said that discipline is the bridge 
between goals and accomplishment. And in this journey, these wooden bridges links me closer to the destination. Ugu Got or Hugot in the Gurung language is a stable for cattle, one of the only stops in the trail where we can have our lunch and rest, situated at 2100 meters above the sea level, offers a scenic beauty, a part of heaven on earth. Due to the festival called Tihar, it's empty when we reached. Here we see goats, they are terrified seeing us. We encountered a landslide area where there were big boulders blocking our path. It made me feel it's no different than obstacles we find in life, but we must tackle them and move to our destination. Finally, we reached Kapuche Lake. We were the only one in the lake area. It's the only place where we could be in wilderness, cook our own food in the firewood. We were in Kapuche Lake Hotel. Owner Rudra Groom gave us keys so that we could have a shelter. After almost 10 hours of trek, we finally went to see Kapuche Lake. It was foggy but beautiful. What could be a better place to worship? than this serene lake and praying to God for my father's soul to rest in peace. Nature's music is never over. Her silences are pauses, not conclusions. Nature has always been important to me. It has always been in my music. Nature is where I can get lost within myself. I'm not afraid of any fear when sound of nature echoes in my ear. Maybe it's not the best place for me, but it's the best place to be. Then I saw a lady waving Nepal's national flag, which added beauty in the lake. The Kopuchi Glacier Lake is located at an altitude of 2,546 meters. This lake gathers glacial melt from Annapurna to Fo and Lamzung Himal. It's the lowest glacier lake in Nepal and even known as Virgin Lake. Nature is somewhere. I can find peace. When I feel exhausted and sad, I am happier when I am surrounded by trees and birds than people. The view of Madhi River, a milky stream flowing from Kapuchi Glacier Lake, simply took my breath away. This area is also a hot spot for wildlife. Kopuji in Gurung language refers to plain surface made of crushed snow and ice. In the end, no possession matters, no status matters, no wealth matters, because nothing else matters except the deeds you do in life. 
It is said that we live in the memories of others after we die. So let's be kind to others. Try to help others. Let's make others smile. And let's leave footprints of goodness. While I trek, I felt pain in all parts of my body. But I lost some pains. Pain in my heart, mind and soul. In this journey of life, we walk alone. We meet many companions along the journey, but ultimately, we start the journey alone and end it alone. Surely the path isn't easy, but in life, nothing is easy. The only difference is the perception. Perception varies along the time, but let's try to be at least a good human being.